Welcome to another edition of Dan Factoids. In this edition we're going to be discussing age restrictions and depth restrictions in diving. So keep watching. We got a question from a diver saying that they had a son of 13 years old that had qualified as a junior open water diver, which meant that they would be able to dive to a depth of 18 meters with an instructor and uh, then ultimately would be able to go to uh, 21 meters under the advanced junior open water diver certification. Are there physiological differences between children and adults and what are the rationale? Well, I am sad to say that it is based on a number of very, very soft principles. The first and perhaps the most significant principle is that we need to know or we need to decide on whether the individual, the child diving, is able to fully appreciate and accept the risks involved in diving. And for that reason, previously the age restriction of 14 was set as essentially the lowest point where it could be reasonably assumed that the diver would be able to make safe decisions or decisions about the safety of diving for themselves. The second aspect is the diving limits. Obviously, the deeper you dive, the greater the chance of decompression illness, but there is not a specific uh, threshold between 18 and 21 meters, although the dive times are significantly shorter. Uh, the concerns about uh, stunted growth and bubbles forming in uh, the growth plates of bones uh, have been greatly exaggerated. But what has been underestimated is the number of uh, atrial septal defects or large PFOs in young children. And that's one of the reasons to try and do bubble free diving uh, when one is under age. So that is certainly something that I would recommend uh, to the individual that posed the question. Uh, but uh, the, the dive limits are fairly arbitrary and they are based on the incidence of decompression illness and um, diving is after all a safe sport if you consider that between one and four per 10,000 dives results in decompression illness of which 99% uh, tend to respond and 95% uh, completely recover with recompression treatment so we shouldn't be too concerned about it but I think it is an important discussion to have with both the child, instructor and the parents uh, to make a qualified decision, not only because the handbook or the manual tells you you can, but taking other factors into consideration such as the maturity of the child to make a calculated risk. Until next time, safe diving.